This video is about the main differences between ScreenFlow and uh, Premiere Pro CS5.0. Oh, the main difference between it is that Premiere Pro is for professional video editing, mainly working with recordings, and ScreenFlow works with screen recordings of your screen and audio and video through your uh, built-in camera and audio source or with anything which you connected to your computer and otherwise uh, ScreenFlow gives you tons of options when you're editing such videos which I'm doing now and Premiere Pro you can edit this kind of videos as well or you can edit professional ones recorded by HD cameras such as a Sony Handycam HD camera and the main video for the main screen of Premiere Pro is this which you can see but there are others for let's say audio which would give you the options of manipulating audio it's a very complex program mainly for semi-professional professionals but it can be learned by amateurs but I would advise it for more of the people who work with massive amounts of videos and need a complex editing. A lot of people would say that you should use other programs such as let's say uh, Final Cut uh, Pro or Final any part of Final Cut but it's uh, it doesn't make that much difference which one you use Mac users would probably say to use Final Cut but this is a pretty good one as well uh, ScreenFlow has a very nice simple layout and can be helpful for editing for very long a very long video or even a short one but it is helpful and there are a lot of options of editing sound or the origin recording or screen recording properties call out actions for mouse which would give it to zoom in or any other options you can add text and or add any extra this is a sample document of a screen recording of mine partially from a YouTube video. So I think so this is the basics for it. There are bo both tutorials for ScreenFlow and Premiere Pro CS 5.0. So see you guys hopefully soon. Bye.